Sunday, we have a super summer soaker Sunday <laughs> uh, with a great big water slide and super soakers for the kids. We've got a barbecue afterwards. It's going to be a lot of fun, a great opportunity for you to invite a family, to head to church, uh, invite a friend. We're going to have a lot of fun next Sunday. We may even get a bit wet. Um, maybe the adults can get a bit wet too. Uh, it's going to be a great day. I've got some exciting news this morning. Um, as many of you may be aware, we have a, uh, every service Sunday morning, we have Mandarin translation. So as we are enjoying uh, the service in English, we have uh, someone translating, it gets put on an iPhone and you'll see people with earbuds in and they're getting a Mandarin translation, which is fantastic. For several years, it's really been on our heart to... Um... But before we do, I'm going to introduce Helen. We're going to have a bit of fun. I'm going to say something, and Helen's going to interpret in Mandarin. And I've never done this before. So you ready? For many years... How many, how many, how many words do I have to say? A sentence? You're good. I'll say a sentence. For many years, um, it has been on our heart for several years 
to have a Bible training in Mandarin. 多年来，在我的心里面有一直有这样感动，要啊、uh, 开一个中文的这门徒训练课程。And the reason for this is because、um, many Chinese people are very unfamiliar with the Bible, even、uh, basic elements about the Bible. They're very unfamiliar with that. 原因是因为很多中国人，当他们当信主的时候，对圣经一点都不了解。And as a result, when they come to know Jesus, it's like their eyes are open, and there is such a hunger and a desire in their heart for the Word of God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. When they first meet God, they have such a deep desire to meet God. 二月六号开始，在我们教会会开一个门徒训练的啊、uh, 中英文这样子双语课程。And this discipleship course will go for eighteen weeks, so it's a very solid course of digging deep into the Word of God. 这将是一个十八课的啊十八课的课程，是一个非常好的课程，会完全帮我们啊、uh, 认识圣经一个很全面的一个认识。So we are very grateful to God because this is an answer to our prayers. We are grateful to God because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people grow in their faith and develop and go dig dig deep in the Word of God. Because we want to see all people Uh, we are secure in the Word of God. It's the anchor to our soul. So much comes from the Word of God deep in our heart. We can find this anchor in God's Word. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. We can find more about who we are in the Word of God. Please feel free to invite them.、Uh, Helen is going to be at the info desk after church to answer anyone's questions, and、uh, there's more information on the info desk. So I just want to say thank you and praise God for that. So, so, if we, in the group, you have met with or spoke Chinese, ah, their disciples, you can invite them to attend this course. If there are any questions, we, ah, we can over the end of the service, in the front desk, I will help them in the front desk. And watch out what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. You must watch what God is going to do. So we take a moment to complete our connection cards. You will find them in your pocket, in front of you, or on your seat. This is something that we do every time we gather together. If you're a regular with us, if you complete your email address and、uh, your prayer request, if you're new to Hope, well, we're just so glad that you're here today, and we'd love for you to use. Just this little piece of paper as a way of connecting with us. As you'll note, there's a spot there for your prayer requests. We would love to pray for you this week. Whatever a situation may be heavy on your heart or something that's really bothering you, you can write that down, and we will pray. We pray for every request through the week. There's also space there. It's a new year. If you're God stirring you up in some way, and you'd really like to be involved, do something, learn something, there's plenty of space for you to write that desire there.、Uh, so let's fill it out together. Receive them when we、uh, collect our giving. 
and Pastor Wayne now is going to come and encourage us in our giving today. Fantastic. As you know, there's uh, three ways that we can give here. I like to call it the three C's, the cash, the card and the computer. But uh, you can use the envelopes and you'll find a blue envelope like that just where you found your connection card and you can put cash in there or you can also write your card details on there. You can use the machine at the reception desk or you can give online. I like using the card. I like writing my, my uh, credit card numbers on there but sometimes I do it at the desk. There. So, we like giving here. Let me read to you a couple of scriptures. The kingdom of heaven is like treasure that is hidden in a field. When a man found it, he hid it again, and then in his joy he went and sold all that he had and bought that field. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant looking for fine pearls. When he found one of great value, he went away, sold everything he had, and bought it. So here you can have a guy who's wandering around, walking on somebody else's field, trespassing, and he stumbles across this incredible treasure. And he says, I'd like to have that. But he buries it, hides it again, and then he goes and sells everything he has in order to buy that field. And they didn't have mining rights back in those days, so he was able to get everything that was in the field. Here's another person who is actually actively searching for something. He's a merchant. He's searching for fine pearls. And he finally finds one which is of incredible value sells everything else that he has in order to obtain it. Whether you were somebody who stumbled into the Christian faith or somebody who was actively searching and God met your needs, we're here now, those of us who follow Jesus. We're in it. We're in part of the kingdom. We have received the treasure. We've received the pearl of great price. And so we're his we belong to him. We belong to our God and Father. We belong to the Lord Jesus Christ. Our goals and our dreams belong to him. Our time and our talents belong to him. Our passions and our possessions belong to him. We're his. And that's why we give. God's not like a dictating tyrant who controls everything that we do and punishes us if we do the wrong thing, slaps us over the wrist. He's a loving father. And the reason why we give, because God has given us so much, and in response to that, we're saying, God, we want to, we want to do things your way. We want to have our priorities as your priorities. We want to have our values as your values. So God encourages us as we understand it, in common with most churches around the world, that a tenth, the tithe of our possessions, goes straight back to the kingdom of God. And if you're part of this church, that's what, that's what our tithes are for. It's, it's, it's our giving to the Lord through the expression of this church. But the other 90% we're still stewards of to, to, to use that in godly ways with his priorities. And so that's why we give today. Come back to that. He, we're his... We've got the treasure of great price. <laughs> the, the blessings of the kingdom are beyond measure. We experience a little bit of that now, not all of it. And we come and we can give now. So, if you've put some money in there or written your credit card details on there, if you've given online, if you're going to use your card at the reception desk later, let's just pray as we ask God's blessing. Lord Jesus, we want to thank you for your provision for all our needs. We want to thank you, Lord, for the blessings of the kingdom. And we want to thank you, Lord God, that, that we can be part of what you are doing in this world. Thank you, Lord, that you include us. And Lord, we pray that the cash that we give, the money, uh, Lord, that, that it would be used to bring about great benefit, that other people would be drawn into the kingdom, that, that difficulties would be alleviated, that people would learn to live in godly ways. God, we pray that, that this would expand and grow and that your influence in this world might be increased. God, we pray your blessing on the gift and the giver now as we worship you in Jesus' name. Why don't you get your connection cards and your offering envelopes and put them in the bucket as they go. Thank you. We're going to stand and sing.